Save 10% with my code BOBBY10 on raw, organic, grass-fed and grass-finished freeze-dried organ meats from Grassland Nutrition. Link in the description box. Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new, my name is Bobby. Yes, it is me, the emotional ice block. Guys, since I reacted to Quran recitations, you apparently want me to cry. So today I have to react to the try not to cry challenge. As I said prior, I'm not trying to act tough here. However, when I read the Quran or listen to it, for me personally, it is logical. It makes sense. It does not make me cry. Cry. Nevertheless, this is the try not to cry challenge, and all I have to say is challenge accepted. Let's have a look. Brothers and sisters in Islam, look at the greatness of Allah in reward. In reward, you do something good. I think he already got rewarded. He has a pretty big golden watch. <laughs> Come with one good deed. Come with one now, we'll multiply to ten. Who is the greatest? He reminds me of those black Christian preachers. Who is the greatest? Allah. And brothers and sisters in Islam, come with one sin. فَلَا يُجِزَا إِلَّا مِثْلَهَا Ya Allah مَا أَعْضَرَ Come with sin, he said he will give you only one And that sin, if you repent إِلَّا مَنْ تَابَ وَآمَنَ وَعَمِلَ عَمَلًا صَالِحًا فَأُولَئِكَ يُبَدِّلُ اللَّهُ سَيِّئَاتِهِمْ حَسَنَاتِ اللهم لك Maybe I'm just too cynical or something, but for me it doesn't seem real. It seems like an act. <laughs> Again, please don't take offense, guys, in case you're following this man, but for me personally, it simply doesn't seem authentic. <laughs> I don't see tears either. Look how great he is. He said, you see that one sin? That if you do, he will give you only one sin. He said that sin, if you repent, if you believe, if you come back, he will turn it into reward. Who is the greatest? Whoever repents and right, acts righteously, Allah said, I will forgive him. Whatever you do wrong, I will live. Again, guys, this really seems like an act to me because he's switching through the emotions way too fast. We watched another recitation where Sheikh was crying, and there you see he breaks down, starts crying, and he cannot stop. This guy, however, is crying and then goes back into preaching, back into crying, back into preaching. It doesn't seem authentic to me. <laughs> See, now again. <laughs> so, brothers and sisters in Islam, love him, he is Azim. Obey him, he is the greatest. Because we belong to him, we will go back to him. So, brothers and sisters, the ultimate return is to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and he is the greatest. Believe in him. Trust him. I agree. Rely on him. He is Al-Azim.
All right, guys, and this is it for today's short video. Challenge accepted and challenge passed. I would say this video definitely didn't make me cry. Yet again, not to act tough or anything on those lines, but for me, this particular video didn't seem genuine. If a woman cries, for example, it's not a big deal. Women cry often, women are emotional. However, for a man to get very emotional and to cry, then you know this is serious. And when a man breaks down into tears, this man cannot just snap back into a happy preachy mood afterwards. So therefore, again, forgive me if I'm wrong, but this didn't seem authentic to me at all. Anyways, guys, this is it for today's short video. If you want to make me cry, post videos in the comment section. And yes, I will absolutely watch them. However, I do doubt that they will make me cry. Everything that he said here whilst reciting the Quran was so beautiful, so logical. It just makes sense and appeals to my rational mind, not to my emotions. All right, but this is it for today. Guys, if you liked the video, nevertheless, leave it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, guys, please do so. And if you want to support me on Patreon and through other ways, you can find all the links in the description box below. Thank you so much for your ongoing support. As always, may God bless you all. Much love and peace.